Welcome to the vlog. Today is a day in the life. School is in full swing. So we are getting back, slowly but surely getting back into our routine. So we just pulled up to the school. We are in the drop off line. This is Tatiana's second day. So Tatiana has already started, but Ava has not. She starts tomorrow. They're doing like a staggered entry for the pre-K. So Ava's gonna be home with mommy today for one last day. Again. And then tomorrow okay. Ava starts her first day. And then how about Say hey. Oh well. I'm sleepy. <laughs> you sleepy still? I see the kindergarten playground. What? Today Ava has a doctor appointment. She has to get a physical <laughs> done for school, which it was due her wellness check was due anyways because her birthday just passed. So she's having her four year wellness check today and then i'm basically going to be in the kitchen a lot today because i have to do a lot of prep i do pack the girls lunch and snack as y'all saw that in the intro so today i'm gonna prepping and doing like some blueberry muffins for snack and some homemade granola bars and i wanted to make my detox juice as well with some more of those gluten-free chocolate chip cookies just to have because they already ran through those so you guys are gonna be a part of it you're coming with it's gonna be a little bit of this a little bit of that a day in the life you know a realistic day in the life mommy vibe so i'm dropping one off i'm gonna have one at home still we have a doctor's appointment and we got some baking in the kitchen she's been wanting chocolate banana bread i need to find a recipe for that leave me a comment down below if you got a good recipe for the chocolate banana bread because i haven't really looked into it yet she's been asking but i haven't looked into it because i've just been all over the place but i'm gonna make it for her soon but not today today i'm working on the homemade granola with 
homemade blueberry muffins and just set myself up for success for the week so that they can have snacks homemade snacks to bring to school I do make them breakfast before they come to school this one still goes to breakfast even though she eats breakfast at home and then I make them lunch and then I send a snack then when they come home they have dinner a whole lot of prep a whole lot of work I'm gonna chat here with her for a little while before she gets out for school so I'm gonna check back in with you guys in a little while when we are back home so we made it back home you guys and now we have a little bit of time from now until Ava's appointment so I want to try to get going in the kitchen and get done what I can prior to her appointment these are the books I'm gonna be using for the chocolate chip cookies I am using this gluten-free book for the blueberry muffins I'm getting that recipe from the practical paleo and then the granolas this actually was a recipe that Tatiana brought home from school from her cooking class. So I am going to substitute some of these things out and I won't be using brown sugar. I'm going to be using coconut sugar and I'm not going to be using the all-purpose flour. I'm going to be using coconut flour. These are the baking chips I'm going to be using. These are from Lily's. So no sugar added. We're gonna be going with those today. So I have decided to start out with the granola bars. They usually come together fairly easy. I've already gotten like my measurements measured out. I'm just gonna use my hand mixer for these. Granolas are getting ready to go into the oven. Now I am moving on to the blueberry muffins. The granola bars just came out. They are looking yum. Now I'm gonna bust out these muffins and I think I'm gonna have this pause there so we can head to her appointment and then finish the rest when I get back. The muffins are about to come out of the oven and they need to hurry up because I'm calling it very close. We need to jet out the door and head to Ava's appointment. We have arrived. So we just pulled up and I hope the muffins are okay because I had to actually pull them out a few minutes early because it was just cutting it too close with time. But we have arrived. We got our documents here for school. And we're gonna see what they say. You ready to go to your appointment? What were you eating? What were you eating? Ava! <laughs> Ava, what were you eating? What were you eating? A seaweed snack? Yes. This one will be barbecue. 
Hey Barbie. 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 This way today. We never went to room seven before. Erica, and I'm gonna put you your arms for Okay. Hey, to sit on your bottom. No. Yes. Please, love. All right. Can we can we try to do this? No. Why no? Why no? No, it's not scary. No. Please. No. Yeah. You have that, right? You do it on mommy and sissy. Okay. Ready, love? So now you're gonna feel like I'm squeezing your arm a little bit, okay? Ready? See, squishy, 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 squishy. So we are back home, you guys. The muffins did okay, and the granola is done. Ava did not want to cooperate at her appointment, so we were there for a little bit longer than I anticipated. But I'm gonna try to get the cookies done, so what I usually do is make the dough first, and then I refrigerate it for a couple of hours, and then I portion it out and freeze it. So I'm gonna try to at least get the dough mixed right now before I have to go pick up Tatiana from school. So let's jump into that. <music> in the refrigerator for three hours and I'm about to jet out the door and pick up Tatiana from school. Pick up her sissy. Pick up her sissy. Gotta make some space in this refrigerator. So that is going to chill and we, we are going to ride. Here are the muffins and the granola. I'm gonna have to mess with that when I get back. What is up you guys? It is the next beautiful morning. So I did not finish up yesterday's vlog because I was just all over the place you guys. Just trying to get in the swing of things. Back into the swing with the back to school. But today is very bittersweet for me you guys. I just dropped Dr. Jenna and Ava off at school. And I got a little emotional when I dropped her off. I'm not even gonna lie. It is very bittersweet for me. Ava has never been away. She's literally spreading her wings and just have left the nest. And she did so well. I wasn't sure how she was gonna react, but she did very well. She went right off because the parents were not allowed to walk them in or anything. So she just went off on her own. No problem at all. So today I am currently at the nail salon. I'm about to get me a pedicure and then I want to stop over at the Gap and get them like a couple of more tops for school. It's right next to the bookstore so I might swing in the bookstore just to browse at a couple of book options that they have and I really wanted to hit up the gym today but I think with everything else that I got going on I'm not going to do that until tomorrow. So tomorrow is probably going to be my first day at the gym. I did get my gym membership last week and I'm going to have an assessment coming up to check like BMI and go over the equipment and everything so I'm looking forward to that it's gonna be a whole new me whole new journey right now my appointment's at 9 30 it's like 9 15 so i got a couple of minutes i'm just patiently waiting for them to open so after my pedicure i'm gonna be heading straight to the gap and then i still need to go home and mess with the cookies because i did prepare the dough for the cookies yesterday and i put them into the fridge but i did not scoop them out and portion them out individually like i need to so that's on the list to do today and then i need to cook and all that jazz before i pick up the girls from school and i need to tidy up around the house so so, since I didn't finish yesterday's vlog, this is day number two. You guys are going to be a part of it. You're coming with, of course. So, I'm about to run in here and get my pedicure. I have my bag here. So, I'm going to be editing while I get my pedicure. I will see you in the nail salon. <laughs>
pedicure is done. She did so good. The nail tech that I go to, she does an amazing job on my feet. She told me today that she's about to be out for five weeks now. She's about to go to Vietnam, so I'm sad. I won't be able to get a pedicure until she gets back. But we headed to the Gap now, see what I can find for the girls, and then home to eat some lunch. I'm getting a little hungry, so let's see what they have at the Gap. <laughs> I just pulled up into the shopping center where I th where Gap usually is, but to my surprise, I think it's closed down. Like it's not here anymore. It was right here, but it's right next to the bookstore. So I'm just gonna run into the bookstore while I'm here because I'm already here and just see what they have. Just browse a little bit. The bookstore literally used to be right here and it is no longer there. Maybe it got moved. I don't know. It used to be right here. And now it is not. So the bookstore is down here. There goes no gap today. So I'm just going to go to the bookstore and just browse and then I'm gonna go home because I'm getting hungry. My stomach is starting to growl. So it is time for me to eat, but I do wanna take a peek into the bookstore while I'm already here. I didn't get anything today. I just was looking around, seeing some new potential reads after I finished the book that I'm reading. But right now I'm actually walking to nothing but cake, nothing but cakes to get hubby a cake. And then I'm headed home. Oh, are they close? Are they close? to the house. It feels so totally weird with pulling out without Ava. I kept looking in my back seat, checking. Weird, gotta get used to this. I'm always used to having Ava, but I'm back with the cakes. And I just noticed when I was pulling up, my butcher box has arrived. It's at the front door, so we're about to unpack that.
lunch, guys. So I'm about to make me a little hamburger. I'm gonna hold the bun and use some of this romaine. So my patty is cooking right now. And I'm thinking I'm gonna sit outside on the back patio and eat my lunch. And I still need to fill out some paperwork for school that needs to be turned in. So I'm planning to do that and I need to prep these chicken wings for dinner. Time be flying. It's gonna be time to pick the girls up in no time. I took the cookies out, but they're still really hard. So I can't do anything with them yet. I'm waiting for that to thaw out a little bit so I can scoop them. I'm about to get those put into the freezer and then it is almost time for me to go and pick up the girls I'm so excited to see them. I text Ava's teacher and I was like, hey, I'm thinking about Ava How's Ava doing and she sent a bunch of pictures and she was doing great So that makes me feel better because I have been missing her today But I'm gonna put these in the freezer bag put them in the freezer and we'll be using these over the um, next couple of weeks And I did get a cantaloupe from my garden. This is my last cantaloupe Mmm, it smells so good. Nice and sweet. And then we're gonna go pick up the girls. You guys, I'm at the school. I'm in the car line waiting. And I keep looking in the back seat thinking that Ava is in the car because she's usually in the car while we are waiting to pick up Tatiana. But she is not in here. My baby is in school. So I'm the first one in the line. I'm just waiting for them to come out and I'm gonna get their reaction and see how their first day was. I'm glad that I'm gonna be able to document this so we can look back on it on another time, you know, later on. I'm out here looking crazy but it's okay but they starting to go through the line and come out so i'm gonna put the camera here and see what they say so we just made it back home you guys and i honestly thought that they were going to come out all happy and everything since i've seen pictures of ava having such a great day today but unfortunately she ended up falling asleep for a nap and they woke her up too soon so she was extra cranky she came out crying and just unhappy so I just turned the camera off and didn't even record that because I was just trying to deal with her emotions. But we're home now. We're going to get showered off and just chill for the rest of the evening. So I'm going to end this vlog here. Thanks for watching to the end, you guys. Thanks for being here, hanging out with me today. Make sure you meet me down in the comment section below. Subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you guys in the next one.